Hello friends, I'm Lord of the Manor, Colonel Failure, and we're back in medieval times with Foundation, a uh, game soon to be hitting Steam Early Access. Uh, and uh, I've, I'm setting up some kind of medieval village. It's been a while since I've done that, uh, and uh, and people felt that uh, that perhaps one should be building a new medieval village. Uh, anyway, we'll go to the village centre to begin with, and, uh, and we'll set that up. Now, I think I'm going to set the centre of my village... Uh, more or less uh, there. There you go. And uh, lo and behold, plunk. We've got a we've got a whole bunch of big-eyed people uh, with uh, with varying expressions um, who are who are ready to do my bidding, or at least they they will attempt to do so. Uh, so uh, on your uh, on your team list for the day, we've got Virginia, uh, Walter, oh typical, uh, Kernigunda, uh, Friedrich, Rupert, Lillian, uh, Wilhelmina. I assume. Wilhelmine, are you a... Uh, yes, you are. Uh, and, uh, and Richard. Uh, Dickie there is, uh, is rounding out the... Cr let's zoom out a bit. Let's, uh, let's, get, uh, let's get ourselves situated. Uh, right, so we've got to build all the fundamentals in that way that uh, you often have to do. Uh, we'll bang our, uh, our lumber camp over there. Give that a bit of a, bit of a spin round and uh, just, just plunk it in there. And, uh, I don't know, who do we think, uh, well, I'll tell you what, number one on the list, uh, Virginia, you're going to be a builder. Congratulations. Uh, you've got a career for life. Good luck if you ever fancy doing anything else. A builder is what you're going to be forevermore until you're crushed uh, by falling debris, which uh, I imagine will happen immediately after the bombastic intro. Now, as a level zero builder, Virginia is not exactly full of hustle, so uh, so I'm going to give uh, give us some backup uh, with uh, Walter and Kunigund, uh, who can also uh, Kunigund, Kunigund, uh, are also going to assist uh, there uh, to get the uh, the old lumber camp up. Well, we've done it. Okay, fine. Uh, in that case, they need a new job, don't they? Uh, right. We'll bung a gathering hut uh, down here to do a spot of gathering uh, about there. Splendid, and uh, and a stone cutter's camp uh, to be doing some stone cutting, uh, and uh, at the weekends they go camping. Um, right now, then we'll get. Uh, I ought to leave this list up. Really, if Banish taught me anything, it's uh, leave that list up. You are now a woodcutter, Friedrich. I uh, hope you like axes and termites uh, because you're going to become intimately familiar with both. Uh, in the fullness of time. Um, right, now, I'm building without any real plan, per se. We're on the, uh, on the Riversy map here, and, uh, and that's largely because uh, I like a river and, uh, and fancy building a bridge. I've got to set an extraction zone. Uh, it's got nothing to do with helicopters, you understand. This is, uh, this is purely about where people are allowed to extract from. Uh, how about all of this? Right, just uh, if you see it, dig it. Is uh, fundamental. Harvest it uh, and uh, and stick it in uh, in a safe place for later consumption. There you go. I don't want to do that. Oh, I missed a bit. There you go. Right, that's that done. Uh, yeah, take no chances on that front. Everyone can harvest absolutely everything. I, I leave nothing off the table. Gathering huts done. Rupert, go get your hands stuck into some berries. See how you get on with that. And, uh, and hopefully it will be a, a fulfilling um, exercise of some kind. Uh, who we got chopping away here? He's, uh, he's going hammer time. Uh, that's, uh, that's Walter. He's, uh, he's, he really hammered the heck out of this collection of rocks. Solid work there, Walter. In fact, you seem to have so much affinity for it. I'm going to make you a stone cutter. Um, I don't need that many builders. Uh, you lot, just uh, hang around looking sheepish. That's it. Good job. Well done. Uh, right, now, next up, uh, we'll get a well. We ought to put this... I, I ought to start thinking about where am I going to build my uh, my kind of fundamentals uh, for a, a terrific civilization. Or not. Just bung it in somewhere. Uh, and we'll also get a warehouse on the go, which we will stick here. And that kind of establishes this bit of area as uh, as an area of importance to my people. And finally, we'll get the sawmill up next door to it. Uh, will we? Yeah, I've got the angle I want. Just uh, just bang it in. 
you can overlap stuff at the moment. The, the game is still in alpha, uh, so there will be some uh, some oddities and uh, uh, bizarrity going on from time to time, I'm sure. Uh, I haven't really encountered any yet, but you never know. You can, you can never be too complacent uh, in that regard. Right, let's up the tempo, because uh, sitting around waiting for these people to get jobs done is uh, is like sitting around waiting for people to get jobs done. Well, progress is uh, is ongoing. Uh, we've got a collection of people now hanging out at the uh, watering hole, uh, which is our new tavern. It might look like a hole in the ground to you, friend, but uh, trust me, it's a uh, it's a tavern. Uh, meanwhile, uh, right next door, you've got uh, you've got Rupert here who goes, "Oh sure, yeah, you just like you just like hang out there uh, by the tavern, uh, doing nothing." Uh, me and uh, and Walter will do all the work. Did I say Walter the first? Time? Rupert and Walter, we're hard at work here for your civilized behaviour. And uh, anyway, uh, we're still waiting for the sawmill to be constructed. It's waiting for a bit of stone, and uh, and at the moment we've got all the stone. We haven't got any planks for the warehouse. Uh, it seems to me that uh, the the division of resources has not been exactly uh, awesome so far uh but i could have i could have given priority to one building over the other i i just i just let it uh, let it do its thing uh right now then i think let's put lillian here onto some wood cutting uh kind of a gig now it does occur to me that i'm gonna need to be able to replenish my uh my woody resources uh relatively quickly i'm gonna add um what am, I, what am I going to add? What 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 uh, inspiring adding do I have up my sleeve? I'm going to add a bit more extraction zone over the other side of the river, purely because I don't know if the uh, uh, if my little weasels are going to uh, going to traverse uh, the raging torrent in order to fulfil my commands, uh, or whether they're going to wait for me to build a bridge first. I suspect it's the latter. Um, but uh, but I live optimistically that they will uh, they will somehow uh, create some kind of pontoon and uh, or maybe a raft uh, like that there Huckleberry Finn uh, get themselves across the other side of the river in order to chop things down. We've got plenty of wood for the time being, um, but uh, eventually we will run out. Now I can expand my area as I become more dominant at, uh, at dominating. And, uh, and once I've done that, then we'll, you know, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll up the tempo on a bit of expansion. Um, but right now, we're waiting for these Muppets to, uh, to complete construction on the, uh, on the sawmill. Because then once they've done that, see, I mean, Virginia seems to have her wits about her. She's, uh, or does she? No, she's just knocking around there. Now. Oh, she's gone for another bit of stone, uh, which comes in a handy carrying case. Uh, one might very well argue that uh, we could probably take those handy carrying cases apart and use it to build the foundations of the trading post. But uh, so be it. Uh, right, sawmill is go. Uh, Wilhelmina, uh, you are now our carpenter. Uh, and uh, uh, I, I wish you all the best of luck with that and, uh, and hope that uh, it brings you a great deal of happiness. Uh, Richard, meanwhile, he's living the high life. Uh, over in the tavern, um, and uh, and uh, you know he's just waiting for a, for a plum gig to turn up. And we oh we got some new people arriving. The thing is, where do, I mean, because they wander in from elsewhere. Uh, yes, immigration is happening, uh, but I'm not entirely sure where they're immigrating from. Furthermore, I'm not entirely sure how they're going to get across the river. It'll be exciting to find out. Keep your eye open for little immigrants. Uh, where are you? Come on, chums. You are the lifeblood of my uh, of my fledgling country. Lifeblood, I tell you. Very, very much so. Uh, right, how are we doing? Eight of fifteen planks done. Good. Uh, all the stone it needs. Good. Well, everything's good. Uh, life is sunny. I know mean, uh, the weather's out. Uh, the team are, are, are busy doing stuff. And no sign of my immigrants. I don't know where they've come from. Maybe they got lost. I've got two new villagers, uh, but they don't register as uh, as belonging to my uh, my nation of uh, of glory until they arrive in the city centre. I'm going to guess that uh, that they're not going to do that. All right, what does it cost to build a bridge? 
I, I possibly could have researched this beforehand. Uh, allows, yeah, okay, good. Now then, how does one, um, how, how does wooden bridge? Well, there's a, there's a bit of bridge, look. All right, okay, so if we were to build that, let's build it in line with the center of town. Whoa, whoa, wait, uh, wood, wooden bridge. That, that, that would appear to be underwater. So if we, how does this, uh, I can't, I don't seem to be able to twizzle it. All right, well, in which case, we'll, we'll do that. Mm. Oh, I see. Okay, now we've got some twizzle. There you go. Uh, you have to pick it and, uh, and show it who's boss. Well, I'm boss, quite evidently. Uh, like so. There you go. Get that done. What are you going to cost? A hundred planks? Goodness me. Um, all right. Well, you know, it costs It costs what it costs, man. I mean, you know, you can't... Uh, you, it's not giving me the option to actually start the uh, the construction there, because uh, I have potentially got a bit of terrain alignment collision going on, and not, I might add, for the first time. Does that need to turn green or what? Are you happy? Uh, center camera done that. Wooden bridge. Yep, definitely. De no, no, no. Don't need a second wooden bridge. One, one is quite enough. Maybe I need to uh, to escalate things up a little bit further, up the bank a bit more. All right, that's that end. Then we got this end, and then what do I do with that? Can I do anything with these? Can we can we wiggle those around? No. Toggle building part snap. I'd love to. I arguably I already have. All right, now what? All right, some more. There's some more red balls. Maybe I can play with these. Nope. Okay. So. Uh, what am I missing? Are you not far up enough far enough up the bank? Do you need to be in ah ah ha 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 ah, right. Okay, they have some kind of some kind of ramping system here whereby one may get onto the bridge in the first place. So if I do that and then we grab the one on the other end, I just dragged it too far in. And then uh, I don't know what that no, that's that's underwater. That's that's not going to that's not gonna survive uh, the uh, the review process, one might suggest. How about that? No. All right. Let's uh, let's bring this down here. Everything else is is still ongoing. I've got two new villagers joined the village. No idea where they are. I'm trying to build bridges. Once I've figured out the bridge system here, we'll be uh, we'll be away. For the moment, however, we are not away. What else can I do with this? Is there is there anything? Can I change the elevation? Ooh, bridges are being sent to test me. Maybe maybe I'm just going to have to live without a bridge for the moment. You've got the little white bit on the end. Yes. Uh, evidently, you have not given up on bridge. Why is it that I always get foxed by bridges? Now, is it now going to base that off where I clicked initially? Signs point to yes. Yeah, see that's that's a that's a better height, right? And then we grab that, and now it's it's not at a good height at all. Okay, no, yeah, super duper, right? Try it again. This time, let's not let's not do it in the river. Grab that end. That's it. Yeah, look, like something. No, like, do like, just will you please? Thank you very much. And, and, right, and then uh, and then we'll grab this end. It's not it's not going well, um, but uh, you know we live in hope. Look, this is all my land. I can build anywhere I I ruddy please here. How about that? No. How about this? Do I can I grab the legs and escalate them? No, I can't. All right, I'm gonna have to go and seek out further advice uh, on this because evidently I'm missing something fundamental. Namely, how you build the bridge. Clear. Thank you. Well, what does that do, actually? Didn't it? I'll just, just one more, one more, and then I'll give up. Okay, I promise you. Right, do a bit of that, and then, yeah, do that, and then clear. Okay, it doesn't do anything. It was worth checking, though. 
Uh, right, now then, who have we got working? Get your camera under control. D d don't fight the camera. You, there we go. Uh, so we've got our new trading center up and running. Uh, in slot one, we will store locks. In slot two, we will store berries. In slot three, we will store stone. In slot four, it's going to be planks, your friend and mine. Um, good. Now, I unlock a trade route and I get some uh, some bucks. Or I get I get some extra tools uh, and the, the option to uh, to trade, which will save my, uh, my bank account there. Uh, but in order to actually bring anything in there, we need a transporter. Uh, Richard! Time to get to work, son. Your job is humping gear from one part of the village to another. And uh, I'm sure you'll be jolly happy doing so. Um, meanwhile, any sign of this influx of new folk? Because if, uh, if this is contingent on my having a bridge, we may be waiting until I've spent some time over at Gamepedia or the official Discord or watching YouTubers or or some such behavior. Now, I mean, in the short term, I'm, I'm probably going to be okay reassigning folk, uh, but without immigrants, we're going to have a great deal of difficulty in growing our fledgling nation. It's going to remain fledgling for quite some time. Uh, right, okay, now then, we can take out the first trade route here. Ta-da! Trade routes, unlock sword. Uh, and then we will say we will trade... Uh, I want to keep 10 in stock of everything. 10. Actually, and we won't trade any logs at all for now. Uh, because that way, when we run out of trees, as is invariably going to happen, oh, pretty much immediately, um, yeah, we've got no trade on anything right now. In fact, that might be the, uh, the astute thing to do. Uh, right, two new villagers are joining. Yeah, but they're not getting here. Uh, and that's, uh, I mean, that's quite sad for them. Uh, but for me, it's uh, it could be disastrous. Uh, now then, we can now assign... Uh, we've, got a, we've got a bonus territory. Now, I was going to take probably the other half of the island here, but that doesn't help me out in terms of reaching somewhere that, uh, that may have uh, further colonist enabled type situation. I'm going to grab this one uh, and see if uh, see if I don't have a little bit more success uh, in getting a bridge up. I thought you were going to look at a tutorial. Yeah, but I'm I'm still convinced that I can do it myself. Yeah? So, uh, you know, watch your tone. Whew, all right, then. Uh, right, okay, now then, let's, uh, let's try this once more. Woods and bridge. Let's try it higher up the bank. Right, and then uh, and then we'll grab a bit of it and wang it over here. Now, one end is no longer in my territory, but I'll move that momentarily. Now, I suspect that both ends have to be uh, immersed into whatever it is you're bridging and hitting the land, so something like that. But the problem is, when I do that, it sinks. And therefore, a certain amount of, uh, of end clippage may be required. Uh, I mean, we can get over here to go and chop those trees, except, <laughs> except of course, no, you can't. All right, I'm definitely going to have to investigate that a little bit further. Uh, anyway, in order to get up to the next level of, uh, of villager development, and as you can see, the, uh, the number of trees we've got left is, uh, is slim. Um, we've got 102 logs, though, and we've got 63 planks. That's a good sign. Uh, we might flog the, uh, uh, the nuts and berries that we've been catching. Catching? Sure. Yeah, that's, a, that's obviously a thing. Uh, and the stone as well, because so far it doesn't look like the stone actually runs out. So if I sell them, that could get me uh, at least some cash in order to be able to, I don't know, something. Um... So we've got some we've got construction resources as long as I don't spend them willy-nilly. And that's okay. A woodcutter could not find accessible resource. Uh, right, okay, now that we've got a quest from the king. I'm gonna help my people. I think. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna help I'm gonna help my people. Uh, get it delivered. There we go. That got me ten points worth of uh, worth of goodness here. Labour points. 
So I can un unlock the fisherman. Great. Once I've got a couple of surfs. Uh, and uh, in order to make surfs, I need to uh, upgrade everybody by uh, by creating a market. Now, the downside to that is I need 200 quid uh, in order to build a market in the first place. So I'm going to be hanging around for a while, figuring out uh, how one uh, makes some money. I don't, I'll make some money as long as this trade center kicks off. You never know, could happen. Uh, anyway, I'll be back in uh, in a little while with a bit more of the same. Uh, if you enjoyed this one, why not subscribe to make sure you keep up with whatever hijinks go on and uh, uh, fling a like at it if indeed you did like it. Uh, I'm going to go and look up how you make a bridge uh, while fiddling uh, my expenses with the king in order to get a nice beefy tax rebate. Uh, I'll catch up with you very soon. Thanks for watching. Cheerio! Hello, I'm Colonel Failure and here is my tutorial on how to build bridges in Foundation. Uh, you will notice in the panel that allows you to actually build the bridge uh, that it says uh, that you need a certain amount of materials. And if that is coloured in red, you don't currently have the materials. It will not allow you to start building that item until you have the materials. That was the error that I made there, friends. Uh, was that I attempted to build a bridge without having sufficient materials. Uh, so this is all good, it just means I've got to hang around for a bit, save up a bit of plankage, and, uh, and then bang it out in order to let the punters in. Jobs are good, and uh, I'll start that at the start of the next episode. Uh, which will, if it's ready already, it will appear for you, especially, right over there. Okay? Uh, if I haven't done it yet, there'll probably be something about buses. Could happen.